poor to me. Okay, good morning. Welcome to a workout using the chair. It's going to be 15 minutes. We're going to do some weights in there. But I wanted to basically expand some of my um, YouTube videos. Um, and even though in the community I do lots of seated based workouts, I've got many that people can access if I'm away. So I thought, well, why not? get one done and um, those that are joining me live can have a uh, have a little go as well and give me some feedback so that would be great so you're going to need a chair I um, have two sets of weights that I normally use I normally use fours and threes I can't find my threes so I've grabbed twos now I would always say that if you've never worked with weights any weights that you put in your arms are going to be more than what you've normally worked with but um, if you have worked with weights and you're finding, like I always go for about 10 reps. And if you're thinking, I can have a conversation, then that's not, <laughs> that's not working anything. So you want to be able to get to sort of seven, eight, nine, and then really sort of feel a difference um, with, oh, yeah, I can start to feel this. And it might not, you might not feel it in the first set. But if I do two to three sets, normally by the second set and definitely the third, you're definitely feeling that burn. So I'm going to pop the music on. Just give me a thumbs up if you can hear the music so I know we're good to go. Um, get your seats ready. Get your weights ready. Now, if you don't have any weights, tins of beans, um, bottles of water, even though these this bottle is really big. Can you, can you see how big it is? That's my head and it's much bigger than my head. So, um, yeah, two bottles of water. Um, anything really that you can sort of make use with. So here we go. So let me do the music test first. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Okay. Hang on. Because I've just got to come off this. Give me a thumbs up if you can hear the music. Yay! Okay. So it's all going to be on the chair. So even that heart rate, just start marching. I'm going to bring the camera down slightly because I can see my feet are slightly out of shot and march the arms as well. So even with our warm up, hello, we're going to march. No, you need to go away. <laughs> now bring the arms and bring them down. Bring the arms over the head, bring them down. So we're going to go into a box step and in, box step and in. Use your arms. He's bringing his bed out now because he's thinking, well, if she's out here, I'm going to bring my bed out and at least I'm comfortable then. Jet, lay down. Lay down. All right, other side. So box step, lead the other leg. Breathe it in, breathe it out. Even at this point, nice and strong with the arms. Keep your body upright in the chair. Three more sets. So when we're in the chair, we can't do any sort of leg curls, but we can still do a knee lift with a little bit of a twist. So think of it as an aerobic warmer. You can bring elbow to knee if you want to, or hand to knee. Use the music. Jet, stop it. <laughs> you naughty dog. It can't go on my YouTube channel now, can it? I've got to stop this dog from pumping this bed. So in and out. Keep <laughs> going. Look at him. That's naughty. <laughs> Stop it. Have a dog, they said. We'll work out with you, they said. Out and in. So into that start, other side. Two. Nah, he's good, really. Fun, though. He might get me loads of views. I might have a new fan base now. Louise and the dog that humps the bed in the background while she works out. Great. Okay, so let's go into some curls. What are you doing, eh? 
So you're leaning down, don't lean too far. You don't want to tip that chair over. So lifting up into those ab curls. Side obliques. Three minutes gone. All right. So from here, this is where we get our first set of weights. So we're going to pick up our first set of weights and we're going to start with a bicep curl. So I'm just going to turn slightly on the side. My back is nice and straight. Slowly up, slowly down. Ten of these. Three. So I've got my four Ks. Four. Slowly down. Five. My back is nice and still. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Okay, take a breath. Ten seconds. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Set number two. So we go again. Curl one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Ten seconds rest. So this time we're going to go down to one side. Stop bringing that bed down. Stop it. Okay, down to one side. Pull up. Two, three, four, five, six. So these are your lawn mower poles. Seven. Eight, nine, ten. Just rest there. Leave it now. Lay down. Lay down. Oh my God. It's going to start again. Naughty doggy. Naughty doggy. Get in. Five minutes gone. Oh my lordy lord. It's like um, one. It's like it'll be all right on the night, isn't it? Two. Three, at least I find the funny side of it. <laughs> Four. Five. You're a naughty doggy. Six. Seven. Eight. I take all your fun away, don't I? Nine. Ten. Good. All right. So this time, we're going to go both down. So bring yourself just towards the front. Both weights down, you lean down, and then you pull your elbows up. Good. Push down through the feet. Two. Three. Good. Engage your tummy muscles. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine, ten, very good. Take a rest. So, you guys can name this video after. Send me a WhatsApp of what I should title the video. <laughs> oh, right. One arm overhead press. My other uh, weight is just resting in my hip. One, slowly down. Two, slowly down. Three, good. Four, five, five more. Six, seven, slowly down. Eight, it's always the opposing muscle when you're slowly working it down that really benefits. Ten, bring it down, other side, ready? And one, slowly down. Two, so it's a strong press, and then a slow lower. Four, five, six, seven. When you get your weight, eight. It's no fun in this house, is it? Nine, <laughs> ten. All right, well done. So just roll the shoulders. So we're going to do double arm press. So it's an overhead press. Now with this one, again, I'm going to give you that 10. But if you get to 
six, seven, eight, and you need to give yourself a rest, please do so. So engage your tummy muscles. We start from here. We lift up and slowly down. Good, again. Two. Perfect. Three. Four. Five. Slow lower. Six. Now use your breath. Seven. Two more. Oh, I can feel this. Ten. Ooh. Oh, my lordy lord. Okay, so I'm going to come into a fly. So once again, I'm going to just come to the side, lower my shoulders down. My arms are down, and then the weights go out and then in. Watch your head. Two. So the fours on this one, because I'm using my back muscles, I would normally go down to a three. Because I really want to get my shoulder blades nice and close together. Keep the arms nice and soft. So don't lock at the elbow joint. Five. Six. Seven. So these ones are a little bit light. And the fours are a little bit heavy for my flies. Ten. So normally I would be on a three. So just have a rest. We're going to do another set of those ones. So bring it down. Oh, you're so handsome. Okay, so bring it down. Arms down. Let's go another 10. One. Two. Keep your tummy engaged. Three. Four. Two more. Good job. All right. Coming back towards the front. So this one is a bent over row. Now, normally I would get you to stand up, but you can do it seated. So if you uh, can stay seated, so your bent over row comes in tighter. So it's not like the lawnmower where you're pulling it up. It comes in tighter to the body. So if you can stand, I put my hand on the chair and then I pull in. So it looks now like my butt has a dog butt. Three, four, five, six. Keep that elbow nice and tight. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's switch the other side. So again, my hand is on the chair. Weight in hand. And I keep that elbow in tight to the body. One, two. Three. Engage your tummy. Really squeeze your tummy muscles and squeeze into your glutes. Remember, you can stay on the seat for this one, but just keep that elbow in tight to the body. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Perfect. Bring yourselves down. So for these ones, I'm going down lower. Shoulders down, and we're going to alternate the arm. So straight out in front, that lateral raise, two, three, lateral front raise, four, five, relax your shoulders, six, seven, eight, nine, Ooh. 10. So we're going to do lateral side raises now, but on this one, we're going to do double the arm. So we go out one, two, so it's different from the fly. Turn to the side, my back is upright. Three, four, five, nice and strong. Six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, lovely, well done. So I'm going to go around the world. So I'm going to feel 
I'll either use the double or I'll use the single on this one. So my weights come together and I go around the wheel slowly down. Then I go the other way. Good. Number six. That's number seven. Number eight. Nine. Oh, beautiful. Okay. So from the next one, we're going to twist. Other side. Three. Watch your head. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Four. Nine. Ten. Bring the weights down. Shoulders are roll, guys. Four. Good. Arms up. Take that stretch. Arms down. Bring the arm across. So this gets in to the shoulder, down the triceps, into the deltoid, down the tricep. Other side. Bring it across. Are you chilling? You're cleaning yourself now. Oh, right, I'm over the top. Try and reach for the elbow, pull down. These stretches are really specific to the workout that we've just done. So if you're feeling a little bit achy tomorrow evening or the next day, so Friday morning, make note of these stretches. Workout complete. Great job. Breathe it in. Breathe it out. Yay! So you get to name my video now. The one where the dog won't listen to me. <laughs> Let me know what you think, guys. It will um it will be available at some point. Okay. Take care. Have a lovely day. See some of you tonight.